Welcome to the recovery room. I'm joined by Football Operations Manager Steve Alessio to bring us the latest injury news. And Cess, you've got a bit of fresh news to uh, kick off. Yeah, a bit disappointing actually. Um, um, Dustin Fletcher um, last weekend uh, hurt his hamstring during training. We tested it out during the week, um, but um, he, he's going to miss this week's game uh, with a hamstring injury. So disappointing. His 379th game, the, the game-breaking uh, game. So uh, disappointing for Dustin and us. Obvious question now turns to if he's going to play on next year or not. Where's all that sitting? Uh, yeah, we're still going through that process now. So, um, yeah, so we're working through that as we speak. Um, but, uh, but unfortunately this week he'll definitely be out. Out of the game, there was only one real concern. Uh, Nick Commer's hand, can you bring us the latest there? Yeah, uh, Nick has broken his hand. Um, he's, uh, he's get, he'll be going in for surgery this week. He'll have that hand plated. It's one of the um, 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 bones on top of his hand. So, uh, um, yeah, that'll be plated this week and uh, he'll miss uh, this week's game definitely. So you guys went in for a few checkups today, is that right? Yeah, a few guys. Um, so um, David Myers, uh, just a check up on his shoulder. Um, that shouldn't be any major issue. Joe Danaher um, um, tweaked his knee a little bit. He's having a check up on that. So uh, uh, we wouldn't expect anything uh, serious out of that check up. Um, so um, yeah, so they'll continue on. They'll be all right for this week. Turning our attention to the possible inclusions this week, uh, we'll start with Dyson Heppel. Last week he was a week by week proposition. Where's that at this week? Yeah, so Dice, um, he's yeah certainly still a week by week proposition. Where uh, to the point where he's going to go get another opinion on it, on his foot today. Um, so we're hoping for a good outcome from that. Otherwise, um, yeah, otherwise we'll just see what the uh, doctors and surgeons have to say about it. Jason Windelick, is he a chance of returning this week from uh, his hamstring soreness? Yeah, so we've got a few guys in um, in Jason's boat where they're coming back from soft tissue injury. So Jason trained well last week and he'll be uh, training uh, uh, hard this week and the expectation is if he can get through all of training that he'll be available for senior selection. Similar would be uh, Trav Collier, who's um, in the same boat as Jason, and also uh, Scotty Gumbleton, who uh, you know, with his um, um, issue um, a couple of weeks ago is now coming coming good and if he can get through all of training this week um, those three guys will be available for senior selection. That's some good news. More good news for Bomber fans was uh, Courtney Dempsey back out on the training track today. Yeah, Courtney was out. Um, he's been spending a bit of time in the gym over the last couple of weeks. He's uh, beefed up Courtney Dempsey at the moment, and um, but he's uh, started his running program uh, from his hamstring injury, and uh, that's really encouraging, and he's looking uh, moving really well and looking well and feeling good, so that's good. You should also mention Marty Gleeson, who has also returned to the club and, and training after his shoulder reconstruction. Yeah, so Marty, um, yeah, unfortunately, is out for the rest of the season with his uh, shoulder shoulder Rico um, so he's had a good spell at home over the last few weeks uh, he's come back uh, nice and refreshed and invigorated he's around the club and uh, yeah um, really enjoying being back around the boys yes thanks for the update good on you thanks